symbolic in a way that we are going to be pure and today is going to be a new day for all of us. As soon as a decoration came in, the decision was made to send the tribal liaison to the Upper Sioux community for the purposes of establishing nation-to-nation -nation relations and also determine grantee status. This was in support of President Obama's and Secretary Napolitano's initiatives to have outreach and nation-to-nation -nation, uh, relations with our tribes. We also were checking grantee status and the tribe decided they would become a grantee and thus began the process that ended in the ceremonial signing of a FEMA tribal agreement. Well, as tribal liaison, it's our job to be the first contact with the tribe, uh, to determine how they want to proceed with the, with the disaster, completed their mitigation plan in three months. Uh, it is not the result of the tribal liaison specialist uh, doing everything. It's really a culmination of a cooperative event within the JFO between all the departments and the region offices. Uh, every part of the JFO, public assistance, uh, external affairs, uh, operations, planning, are all involved in making this a relationship that works. Several parts of this ceremony that were significant. For example, they began the ceremony with a purification ceremony, which is uh, the burning of sage, and that's to purify or cleanse the area. Uh, secondly, there was a flag entry. The flag entry was led by the Eagle Staff. The Eagle Staff is the symbol of the tribe. It's their most important and their most uh, uh, spiritual object. Uh, that was then followed by the American flag. This tribe honored us and FEMA by asking that we present the Department of Homeland Security flag as part of the flag ceremony. The thing was, it was determined that we had a choice to be a sub-grantee of the state of Minnesota or to be a direct grantee on a nation-to-nation -nation level with the United States of America and the FEMA agency. We're very, very um, happy to be the first in uh, our region to have undertaken the process and, and it is a tremendous acknowledgement um, as to the, um, the uh, history of our people and, uh, and the uh, interaction we have with the United States. I, I think it's important acknowledgement on both parties, the Upper Sioux people as well as the United States FEMA agency that we um, um, understand the unique relationship that we have with each other and that it is very um, important that we continue to um, memorialize events in our uh, people's history that our children can take those into the future and understand the relevance of what has occurred today. Initially we didn't understand that it would be um, such a uh, big event but uh, as we've um, undertaken the process, we do understand the significance of today and we are very appreciative of FEMA's acknowledgement of our nation as well as the historic moment that it, it represents today.